Hello guys, welcome back. In this tutorial we are going to learn about circular pattern. This simple and easy to use SOLIDWORKS feature is very important tool. In this, uh, I have already made uh, a tutorial about linear pattern. Uh, you can get back to linear pattern if you don't know then. Uh, in linear pattern we keep a feature to pattern in linear manner whereas in uh, circular pattern we duplicate our features in circular fashion. Circular pattern is the repetition of given entity multiple times around a defined axis or point. They are defined by number of instances and the angle between them. Circular pattern can be used in many situations and in many applications where rotational symmetry is desired, not just circles or spheres. So in the beginning, a circular pattern can be very confusing. So, but always keep in mind Mm, the basic idea what a circular pattern is, mm, it's a multiple instances of a specific entity or entities around a central axis or in the case of skates, a center point. Uh, so let's start. Mm, here mm, you can see a mm, linear, in linear sketch pattern. Uh, you can see a circular sketch pattern. Here are some circular skates and circular skates pattern are different too. But uh, a circular pattern feature is very similar to circular skates pattern too. So in top lane we are going to skates. Uh, okay. Oh sorry. Skates. And okay I'm going to make one here big circle as well as circle another one here go to dimension put uh, here 200 200 mm and this and diameter mm, about mm, 45 later on we'll need this keep a bit Okay, it's okay. We'll change it later. Uh, then 60, I think 60 is okay. And again, we are going to sketch a model or entity that is to be a circular pattern there. So go to your line. Okay. Mm. Again, go to here for construction. And make the relation here. Uh, it's not. We will do that later. So these two, this vertex and the point on the origin, make sure they are um, particle you can see from the sketch also the lie on the same straight line so they are particle it's okay and uh, select these two um, lines and make relation here symmetric later on we'll need okay and go to smart dimension and keep angle between them to be uh, near about um, 30 and this is okay another one the sketch is not fully defined yet so we'll define it and the distance between this point and this point keep 55 55 so you can see sketch is fully defined and we can uh, proceed to the circular pattern here first of all we have to extrude this feature the contour to be extruded uh, I'll keep here this this and this and this and this also oh, sorry this and this all so and uh, extrude up to Let's see the preview here. OK. 
Okay. Okay, and here I want to make an entity uh, that is to be a keep in circular pattern. And this is my entity. I want to cut this. So go to features and extrude cut and both extrude and select this drop down menu skates and which you want to cut this and this both and direction this is opposite just flip the direction and it will do the its job okay and here again i want to extrude um, here one uh skates and i want to extrude this in up direction here up to 40 mm 40 mm okay so this is our model and uh, we are going to use circular pattern uh, circular pattern means um, basic idea is multiple instances of a specific entity around the central axis or center point here so i want to flip this and the center point here uh, you can see origin here this is the horizontal point and this is the entity uh, i want to create multiple copies of these entities using circular pattern so um, go to here circular pattern and select the uh, uh, features and faces select cut extrude here and the direction here you choose this circular circle and number of instant 10 number of uh, copies and in up to 360 degree this is um, the free view here and you can click ok so I don't know what's this but we have created this using a circular pattern you can add more features on uh, tamper flat here uh, if you want then go to flat and the uh, item to flat click this up to 10 mm this is okay and this choose a You can see this is the beautiful model we have created and this uh, patterns this entity is using circular pattern and you can see here how much a circular pattern is important in solidworks designing uh, so thank you guys don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like the video uh, leave some comment i want to hear from you thank you